taken you on a journey to the Central Arctic Ocean and introduced you to the mission of the Mosaic Expedition. We've looked at all components of the Arctic climate system and then explored a series of broad challenges that the Arctic and those who live there face. But we've also heard that what happens in the Arctic doesn't stay in the Arctic and explored how all of us will be impacted by changes that happen in the Arctic system. We've heard from a large number of experts from different fields and have seen many photographs directly from the Mosaic Expedition. We hope that this, this was a useful and broad survey of the basics that make the Arctic, the Arctic climate system, and the research in the Arctic unique and fascinating. Sadly, our tour is ending, even though there is so much more that we could talk about. Many of the topics we've touched on in 10 minutes or less would be worthy of their own courses. Most of our speakers devote their entire careers to topics they've told you about in a very short time. Thus, there's a tremendous amount of additional detail and nuance to so many of the things we've covered, and we encourage you to explore these issues further in your own learning. We have launched this course in the middle of the Mosaic Expedition, as team members from Expedition Lake 2 are handing over the baton to the next crew of participants who will be the first ones to see the sun rise above the horizon again after months of polar night. Terabytes of data are being collected and scientists are eager to dive into the analysis and see what they will learn from this tremendous data set. Generations of scientists and modelers will analyze the data and work to significantly advance our understanding of the Arctic climate system and the global climate system. With that, we'd like to offer you our most sincere thanks for being our students and thank you for being part of our journey. This journey, of course, could have not been possible without the work and enthusiasm and assistance of a huge number of people who participated in this effort, both on screen and behind the scenes. We'd like to first acknowledge funding from the National Science Foundation, as well as funding and support from the University of Colorado in Boulder, Ceres, NOAA, the Department of Energy, and key support from the German Alfred Wegener Institute as the lead institution for the Mosaic Expedition. Next, we'd like to thank all of our speakers who provided a wide range of perspectives on the Arctic and the Arctic climate system. We asked our experts to condense a tremendous amount of information they know very well into short lectures, and that is not an easy feat. At the University of Colorado Boulder, we want to thank the leadership on MOOCs and support from, for this course from William Cuskin and Provost Russell Moore, as well as the team around Fendel Hollington. Jenny Lane and Scott Milkwall. A huge thanks to the two co-instructors, Lynn Gart, Hardin, and John Griffith from the Series Education Outreach Program for the enormous amount of work they put into making this MOOC happen. Lynn worked with many of our experts, edited slides, images, developed lecture scripts, and envisioned the course. John developed the assessments and has been a fantastic support throughout. Elise Shower spent hours searching for B-roll to support the video lectures. Thank you for your support. All of the cool graphics you saw at the beginning of each video, along with graphics and other images, were the terrific work of Kathy Bogan from the series communications team. A big thanks also to the rest of the series communication team, Katie Human and Katie Weeman, supported the MOOC in so many different ways. And then of course, we would like to thank the many different people who filmed our experts around the world. Some also conducted the post-production on the videos. Thank you all for making this happen and allowing us to feature such a wide range of people and their perspectives. Finally, if you thought this was amazing, how the lectures that were filmed by many different people were all brought together in a format that had a similar look and feel while keeping the unique spirit of each lecture, then join us in thanking Ryan Bashan for his tremendous effort in the post-production of all videos. We're not underestimating when we say that it was a lot of work. Ryan, you have our most sincere thanks. And of course, thanks to you all for joining us. Please do continue to follow Mosaic throughout the year of the expedition and beyond. Continue to interact from Facebook and Twitter, and stay tuned for more Coursera content from the University of Colorado.